When I got the call, um, I believe it was about a double-digit number of people who had been shot at Bunny Friend Playground. Of course, my heart dropped. I got dressed and began to proceed that way. Uh, I had a personal phone call with the mayor to advise him. He advised me he'd meet me out there. And on my way there, I was constantly being updated that the number of people shot was increasing. Um, fortunately, no one died from those injuries. And so that's somewhat of a relief, but it's, it's not very relieving to know that 17 people were shot that day. Uh, some of the injuries were minor, some were major. The mayor and I went to the hospital and met with every single person who had been shot. Three different hospitals we went to that night. Um, and while nobody died, it's still one of the most horrific incidents to happen in the city. That uh, on a playground where 400, maybe 500 plus people were having a good time, people decide to take out their frustrations and anger against other people using firearms. And we're grateful uh, to God that nobody died from that and not more people were seriously hurt. Uh, but the message, we sent a strong message and uh, we made a commitment to bring people to justice. We worked tirelessly around the clock with our federal partners, ATF, FBI, to make sure that we had the resources available to identify people and bring them to justice. And, and so we've delivered on that. And so we look back on Barney Friend and now we make sure that we're staffing correctly, we're in contact with organizers to the extent that we can to know when these things are taking place to prevent a bunny friend from ever happening again.